not barking it. <laughs> For those who don't know what we're talking about, <laughs> the bicycle just went by. <laughs> Unlike the motorcycle that parked right. in front of our window. <laughs> uh. Morning, Larry. Good morning, morning Robin. Joe, morning, how you Joe. doing? It's time hey, to have fun with you. That's exactly why I'm here. <laughs> I'm in the right spot then, yeah. right? And today is December 3rd, so we have three. December 3rd. 3rd. Is her birthday? Oh. Well, happy, happy birthday! birthday. Happy birthday! Yay! Yay. Woo! Happy birthday! Good job! Happy birthday! <laughs> <laughs> it's her birthday, really? I heard her. I read her lips. Yeah. Good. Give me give me your. Show me your driver's license. <laughs> I'll give you a free chicken sandwich. That's all. <laughs> I'm glad you said chicken sandwich. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm not so sure what the driver's license had to do with it. <laughs> I know. To prove it's your birthday. Okay. I, oh. I said, make sure you're old enough and I'll show you my chicken sandwich. <laughs> That's right. Boy, it's getting warm in here again, isn't it, Robert? <laughs> Laura, are you trying to get me in trouble? No, I was trying to keep you out of trouble. That's yeah. it. No, no, that's hard to He's do. Protecting Don't you. forget at the Paddock Mall, Santa Claus is here till 8 o'clock tonight. Santa Claus. We've got a great Santa Claus at the mall, too. Yeah. That's what I heard. Yeah. I heard, ho, ho, ho. Green. Oh, <laughs> <time. laughs> I got you. He's got a wonderful smile. He's just such a great persona. Very personable. He's Santa a nice Claus elf. Here. Yes, he, he's his head elf. All right, sure. we have wait a minute, wait a minute. today what? Wait a I'm enjoying my Starbucks coffee from the mall. <laughs> do you have a flavoring in there today? Ah, uh, hazelnut. Hazelnut, okay. All I do is put a little bit of cream and two shots of hazelnut, mm-hmm. and then the, the Christmas. I think we're doing a Christmas blend. I don't know which blend it is, but it's good. Oh, oh the okay. one that was out there is Thanksgiving blend. Is it Thanksgiving blend? That's what it says. Well, the, then, therefore, I the like label. it. <laughs> well, I, don't, I don't taste any pumpkin in it. No. <laughs> <laughs> what did it just put a label to Thanksgiving? I don't know. It tastes good. Uh, the Starbucks coffee, I didn't think I would get semi-addicted to it. Yes. But it is it is a, uh, you taste the coffee more. I don't know how, why. No, I think you're right. I you think know, some right. coffees you buy. I, I went through the same phase where I thought, why would that coffee be any better than anybody else's? And then you taste it, you go, ooh. Mm. Yeah, I kind of, yeah, right. So stop it and say, hi to me. I became a Starbucks fan late. Yes, yes. Late, everybody else was a fan before I was. There's a muscle man walking by. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, what are we, how are we going to play? Then I'll the game the today is the same as it was the last two days. I will Shoot play some pieces of songs. You tell me who's singing. And today I have three Christmas songs because it's the third day of December. I owe you for yesterday. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We have two Chick-fil-A sandwiches. That's two Chick-fil-A sandwiches at Chick-fil-A here at the Paddock Mall. And for your Christmas shopping pleasure, a $10 gift certificate to Downtown Jewelry and Pawn in Bellevue. That's a $10 gift certificate. We keep adding all this stuff up here. From Bob Wines Camellia Gardens, a $20 gift certificate. That's Bob Wines Camellia Gardens since 1952. Your gardening experts here in Ocala. And then we let... Hey, look at this. Green Giant. (laughs) Steamers. Help with dinner when you win this three-piece nonstick kitchen pan set. Retail value $25. Yes. I would say yes on that. It's good, yes. I've seen the prices on those. And that's Fine Life Premium Bake Set. Cookie sheet, muffin pan, and cake pan. That's a good gift. Especially this time of year. And that's before the disclaimer. (laughs) Yeah. <laughs> if you or your family has won fun with Joe in the past 30 days, you are ineligible to play today. And if you would like to play, you need to call. The number is 622-9622. We need two players. The winner takes all the prizes that Joe just described. Oh, yeah. 622-9622. Again, the game is we're playing pieces of songs. And Joe and Robin have to guess the name of the singer. We'll take a break and be right back. We'll take your calls during that break. The weather is brought to you by MyFWC.com. Safe boating is no accident. It'll be part Partly sunny today, but there can be a shower in the area, mainly along the coast, the high 76 to 80. It's clear to partly cloudy tonight, lows ranging from the upper 50s in a few inland locations to 66 along the coast. Sunshine mixing with clouds tomorrow, there may be an afternoon shower along the coast, the high 76 to 80. On Friday, partly sunny, maybe a shower along the coast, high 76 to 80. From the Florida Weather Center, I'm meteorologist Joe Lundberg. 
Hi, this is JP from Penn Flooring here in Ocala. I would like to invite you to come in and visit our spacious showroom where we have solutions for every style and budget. From wall-to-wall carpet to hardwood floors and tiles, we have an unsurpassed selection of flooring. At Penn Flooring, we've provided quality customer service with a family touch for over 25 years. Visit our website at penflooring.com or come by our showroom, 1201 Southwest 17th Street, just over the bridge. Penn Flooring, quality customer service with a family touch. Experience Christmas at Gaylord Palms, November 15th through January 4th with Ice featuring the Nutcracker. Relive your favorite scenes from the classic ballet, hand-carved in more than 2 million pounds of ice sculptures and slides. Enjoy a special bonus area, the Frostbite Factory, and watch artisans from Harbin, China carve amazing ice sculptures before your eyes. Your awe-inspiring experience concludes with the wonder of the nativity in ice. For tickets and packages, visit Christmas at GaylordPalms.com. All right, 14 minutes before 12 o'clock, we have our players, Doug betting on Robin, <laughs> Terry really? betting on Joe. All right. And now the fun part starts. We, we play the music. Yes, I'll tell you what we're going to play. <laughs> oh, I got some exciting news coming up tomorrow, so listen in tomorrow. Oh, you... <clears throat> no. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Can you tell us today? Did I say tomorrow? Well, that'll be, yeah. that'll be after the news. Yes, you're correct. I won't have exciting news after I give it to you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be post-exciting news. Oh, oh, that reminds me. There was something I wanted to tell you. On the air or off the air? Right, on the air, on the air. Uh-oh. But, but tomorrow, I'm going to tell you tomorrow. Tomorrow was... I can't tell you today. No, you cannot. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's called but a teaser. The I know, I'm teasing you. <laughs> okay. I don't have much hair, so you can't tease it much. Oh, <laughs> no. Mm. Uh-huh. All right, ready? Here we go. Name the singer. But if you lose... Is it war? No. I mean the group. Shaq, Shaq, Shark, Shark. Initials. C M. Cur- Curtis oh. Mayfield. Yes. Good job. Good job. Curtis wow. Mayfield. Right. Wow. Good job. Superfly. Superfly. That's what it was. Superfly. That's what it was. Superfly. <laughs> That's what it was. There's another one you probably will remember. Are you ready? Here we go. Mm. Oh, that's um. Oh, Paula Abdul. Yeah, Paula Woo! Abdul is right. Yeah. Doug is on the board with one, and Terry's on the board with one. One to one. I like this song. Boy, that's 1980s. Yeah. She did it with the cartoon cat or something, right? Don't you think it's a step down when you become a judge on a game show? Don't you think that's a step down? It depends how much money you're making. I guess. <laughs> yeah. You know, I'd be. A, well, you're going to be a judge, and we're going to pay you 1.5 million a year. Uh, okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know, if someone said to me, uh, Joe, I know that you work at a radio station, but we'd like you to be a judge for one million dollars. What do you say? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sign me up. Yes. You know? Yeah, you made a good point. All right, who's this singa? Says, are you think my heart Ma- uh, Ma- Ma- Curtis, uh, uh, Curtis Mathis. No. Uh, Curtis Mathis. <laughs> Johnny Mathis. Mathis. Johnny, yeah. Johnny Mathis. Oh, okay. is Curtis Mathis. I, I wanted Curtis. Uh, that was the TV set. Yeah. <laughs> Two for Doug, one for Terry. Dang it all. Thank you. <laughs> I bet I you the Mathis. I bet yes, you Johnny did. Mathis holds some kind of records for records because he, remember he was like every time he turned around he had another album out. He had so many yeah. records out at one time. He still has that best. smooth voice. He's still Is around. He still out there. Okay, I didn't know. And mm-hmm. the best smile too. Is another one. The first Christmas song of the day. She did this when she was thirteen. Yeah, who is she? Patsy, not Patsy Cline, no. Initial B L. Brenda Lee. Brenda Lee is Good right. Good job. Two to two. We're tied. Oh, I might actually have four Christmas songs. <laughs> I just realized I might have four. <laughs> he just realized he has I four. Know. <laughs> Are you allowed four today? All right, here's another. Here's another one. And I'm left here on my own. That I Conway Twitty. No. Oh, that's... um. Uh-oh, easy, oh, easy, easy, easy. Take it easy now, girl. It's uh, Carney Francis? No. Um, uh, oh, it's... Uh, I'll help you with this one, Robin. Initials, Larry. It'll, it'll kick. D.S. Oh. 
I, I don't know. You got to know. Joe's got to know. I don't know. <laughs> Denise Summers. I don't know. <laughs> Denise Summers. I have Come on, you know? got to know, Joe. Dusty Springfield. Dusty Springfield. That's who it is. Wow. Oh, that's way back. Yeah. Who, who's that point for? I can't tell you till tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that doesn't work with the game. Sorry. No. Yeah, uh, never mind. Give it to Joe. Go ahead and give it to Joe today. Ooh, okay. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. There you go. I'll put it in the bank for tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> wow, she sounded so different than on that uh, Richard Carpenter song. Yeah. Well, no, she wow. didn't. She sounds the same to me, but. I plead, the fi- uh, I plead the fifth. She, Richard Carpenter, after Karen died, yes. Richard Carpenter put out at least one record. I don't know how many. And Dusty Springfield was the singer, took Karen's place. No, no comparison. I know, I know. But our complaint was Richard Carpenter didn't put Dusty Springfield's name on it. Yeah. It said Richard Carpenter on the on the on the label. Yeah. So you go to play the record, go, geez, what happened to his voice? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I he know just, he what was did he, bad. Did he actually sing or did he just did the piano? He did sing a little bit, but he but wouldn't sing much. lead. But he hired Dusty, so it was like when you hire a guitarist for your record. Mm-hmm. You don't say the guitars don't get right. Credit. Right. It's like it's like uh, what was like a distrut in my stuff. Uh, the fooled around and fell in love. Oh yeah, uh, that, that was Mickey Thomas, but it's, yes. but it said uh, the other guy's name. Yeah, the other uh, fool around, uh, the Mar- Marvin Gaye. Uh, no, 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 um, no, never mind. I can't remember. Don't look at me. Right, here we go. Here's another. I one. I plead the fifth. Here's another if one. I get lucky. Janis Joplin. Janis Joplin is right. Three to three. Wow, I'm impressed with that one. <laughs> that was good. That was He's very very good. Wow, she died too young. Here's a, yeah. Yeah, she sure did. Here's another one. See, you know how I feel. Michael Bublé. No. River free. A woman. That's a woman? A woman? Yeah. Blossom on Tracy tree. Chapman? No. You know how I feel. It's a new dawn. It's Initials. A new day. N-S. It's a new Nancy Sinatra? <laughs> <laughs> no. Wow. No. Nicole Simpson, no. <laughs> N S. Is it Nicole? No, no. Is not Nancy, not Nicole. No. Noreen? No. Let's see if somebody knows. Wow. Corey, do you know who that is? Is it Nina Simone? It sure is Nina Simone. Wow. Yeah. Wow. That is for Robin. Good. Thank you. All right. Oh, Doug has oh. four. Terry has three. It's Wednesday. It's supposed to be <laughs> Joe Day. <laughs> Tell you what. Yeah, Nina Simone. I know. Wow, I gotta look her up. Here, Here, it is. Here we go. <laughs> Frank Sinatra. No. Dean Martin? Dean Martin is right. Oh, dang it all. Tell me quick, ain't love a kick. Kick in the head, yeah. For some reason, this is popular right now. It must be in a movie. Don't know. Maybe, maybe it's, the, it's the festive season. Somebody must have used it. I didn't like it. Here's your oh, kick gosh. in the head. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Here's another one. I'll call out for more. Oh my god. 71. That's whiter shade of pale. Initial, please. A L. That's on Alice Cooper, so. Is it Al? A L. No. Alice? No. Is that a he or a she? I can't tell you. Oh, Annie Lennox. Annie Lennox is right. Thank you. You're welcome. Annie Lennox. Mm. Annie Lennox. Oh, she's great. I love her. No. Nope. Music. I knew the song. I didn't know the, the artist. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, right. Because the song was actually made popular by who? Who did White Shade of Pound? Um, uh, Proco Harem. Oh, Proco Harem. Thank you. Yeah. Here we go. Here's Showing it. off. Again. Here's, here's <laughs> another one. Oh, oh, Tracy Chapman. No. Isn't this the car song? No. No. You're thinking it with the key, with the roller skate. That's a guy. Oh, Jack and Diane. This is Jack and Diane. Um. Uh, initial again. Go ahead. <laughs> J M. <laughs> Joe Martone. <laughs> hey, you did it yesterday. I figured. Uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> this is uh. James. No. <laughs> oh, what's his name? Come on, do you know? <laughs> John Mellencamp. John Mellencamp. That's the guy. That's it. I forget about the cougar in there. Who's the point for? Cougar? 
Well, the initials are JM, so I give it to Joe Martone. Oh! Oh! Yeah, he was always John Cougar Mellencamp, and the JM threw me. Which was a uh, an agent's idea. He didn't like it. Remember that mm-hmm. story? Yes. Right, here's, yes. An, here's another one. Bruce Springsteen? No. no. This is, uh... That's too high for him. It's not Mickey Thomas. It's no, uh, no. Initials, I guess. D.F. David Frantain? Frantain? No, no. <laughs> no. Frantain. No. Frantain. No. Oh, no. gee. No. I call in, Doug. Call in, Terry. David? Good morning. Do you know? No, not David. Good morning. Do you know? Dan Fogelberg. Dan Fogelberg is right. Fogelberg. I haven't heard that name in years. That's yeah, right, yes. Yeah. And the point? Joe, please. Thank Ooh. you, sir. Thank you. Five Lord. for Terry and Joe. Six for Doug and myself. Right, here's another my, one. My lifelines keep me alive, yeah. Oh, they bring oh, back memories um, for the can't think of Oh, the Chicago guy. Uh, <laughs> Pete, Peter Cetera. Peter Cetera is That's right. It. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> Just stay there, stay there, Lifeline, and help me. <laughs> oh. All right, here's another one. Oh, that's a girl, finally. That is. Aretha Franklin? No. Ruth Pointer? No. I'm going to st- Donna Summer? No. Beyonce? No. All right, let's go. I will give you her initials. She's got three of them. Oh, really? Special? M J B. Oh, Mary Jean B. Mary Jane Bowles. Mary Jane. Uh, Black. Mary right, Jane. Mary Black. Jane. Right, Mary Jane? No. 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 There you go. Um, okay. You just want some Mary Jane. That's what I it know. is. That's, I love that candy. Come on, you know? <laughs> yeah, Mary Blige. Yeah, That's Mary, Mary Jane Blige. Blige. Yes. That's it. Uh, Who's the point for? Robin was so close, but give it to Joe. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Six for Terry and Joe. Seven for Doug and me. Here's another one. Oh, that's uh, the Canadian lady. Oh, Shania Twain. Yeah, Shania Twain. <laughs> I didn't know she was from Canadian. Wow. <laughs> she wears that yellow jumpsuit. She's cute. I thought uh, Olivia Newton-John wore that. Was that? <laughs> <laughs> right, here's another. Let's get physical, you know, kind of thing. Huh? Is that Rick Springfield? Not Rick Springfield, no. Oh, it's um, Born to Run. It's, uh, oh, what's his name? That's that's the game, oh, Robin. What's Born his name? Oh, Born to Run. It's uh, Bruce Springsteen. Yeah. Okay. Bruce Phew, I'm sorry, Bruce. It took me a while. I'm not going to let you roll anymore. I'm going to cut in. Anyway. <laughs> Here's another one. Patsy Cline. Yeah, Patsy Cline is Good right. Good job. You want me to forget. Seven for Terry, nine for Doug. Ooh. Oh, White Wedding. Uh, she knew the oh. title. <laughs> uh, I would have never known oh, the title. Oh, yeah, was. he's, oh, Sting, no, it's, uh. <laughs> Who's that? Oh. Who's Springsteen, though? I see for a White Wedding, it's, uh. <laughs> Come on, do you know? Oh, my gosh. Billy Idol. Billy Idol's That's right. Who's the, point for? <laughs> Who's the point for? Who's the point for? I'm to get Joe to win. All right. Uh, who wins, Robin? Who wins? Uh, oh. Doug wins with nine. Terry oh. has eight. So, Doug, oh. pick up your prize. Whew. Life, life for trying. Get out. Oh. Wow. Hang in there. Hey, let's do this again tomorrow. I like to be tortured. <laughs> <laughs> and tomorrow I'll tell you the special announcement. And this is WOCA Ocala. The source. Fox News Radio, I'm Lillian Wu. Honda expanding an airbag recall to all 50 states as a Japanese supplier appears before House hearing, maintaining. Takara continues to believe that the public safety is best served if the area of high absolute humidity remains a priority. 
for the replacement of suspect inflators. Hiroshi Shimizu, a senior vice president at Takata Corporation, says the company will take all actions needed to advance the goal of safety. Problems with the airbags blamed for at least four deaths. Texas preparing for an execution tonight. 56-year-old Scott Panetti is due to be put to death tonight in a Texas prison for murdering his in-laws 22 years ago. But his lawyers are demanding new mental competency tests be performed, arguing the results will reveal Panetti is delusional and therefore not fit to be executed. Fox Radio's Evan Brown, Fox News. We report, you decide. Looking for a Medicare Part D plan? Join Express Scripts Medicare. You'll get personalized service from a dedicated team to help you save money and protect your health. Express Scripts Medicare advisors like me can help you save money on your prescriptions. As an Express Scripts pharmacist, I'm here to answer questions about your medications anytime, even in the middle of the night. Get the quality and service excellence you deserve in a Medicare plan. Call an Express Scripts Medicare advisor today. That way you'll be ready when enrollment begins on October 15th. Call Express Scripts Medicare at 1-800-817-4535, 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. That's 1-800-817-4535. Or visit ExpressScriptsMedicare.com. Customer service is available in multiple languages and is closed for Thanksgiving. This is an advertisement with paid actor portrayals. Ferns for Christmas. That story next on This Land of Ours. The Environmental Quality Incentives Program, or EQIP, is a continuous sign-up program allowing landowners or operators to apply for financial and technical assistance from many types of conservation practices. And USDA's Natural Resources Conservation Service in Florida has made it easy to get more details. Just log on to www.fl.nrcs.usda.gov. You'll find state resource concerns along with links to more detailed information on the overall EQIP program. Or you can simply stop by your local USDA NRCS office. Traditional Christmas decorations generally include foliage like evergreens and poinsettias. But another plant you can use to dress up your holiday inside or out is the Christmas fern. The Christmas fern is probably one you might want to find at a nursery that specializes in native plants or a full-service garden center nursery that has quite a range of perennials and ferns. Extension horticulturalist Leonard Perry says you can plant the Christmas fern outdoors, pot them inside, or use them for wreaths. You could add any number of little accessories. You can find the craft shops, little sparkly, glittery ribbons you can string through it or those little streamers, that kind of thing. Usually what it has been used traditionally and still people do is actually cut some of the fronds and use them like you would cut greens, just make it in some sort of an arrangement of mix because it adds that ferny kind of more delicate texture to, say, evergreens that you'd put in like pine and spruce fir, for instance. So it really makes a nice combination there. You can just get some simple branches, say, of winterberry or red twig dogwood that are pretty, have some of that red color and this dark green glossy leaves. The Christmas fern will add a nice uh, contrast in color and texture to those, too. So that's just very simple to, to put something like that in a vase.